Hello everybody. So today I want to talk about physics. The topic today is about the heat. So now I want to show you how to answer the formula of this one. That should be about the total heat. Remove the product. So in this one, we need to calculate about sensitive heat sensible heat number one plus the latent heat and then we need to find about sensible heat number two so the formula of the sensible heat we know that that should be about the mass multiplied by the c multiplied by delta T. That's about the difference of the temperature, number one. Why do we have sensible heat, number one, and number two? Because we have below freezing, that's about this number, and above freezing, that's about 0 0.7. And we know that the point between above and below, that's about negative number three. So if we draw the diagram in here, So we know that from 18 degrees Celsius, we put this number 18 in here, and negative number 3, that's somewhere in here. And the next one, we have negative number 8. So that's why from 18 to negative number 3, that's about the sensible heat number 1. From negative number 3 to negative number 8, that's about sensible heat number 2. And the next one, the latent heat that should be about the mass we multiply by the number they just provide here latent heat 6.12 kilocalories per kilograms that's it about this number in here and then we have m multiplied by c multiplied by delta t number 2 So now we just put the, the we put the numbers in here, and we have eight thousand. We multiply by C above freezing. That's about zero point seven. So the different the temperature from eighteen to negative number three. So we put number eighteen. We minus negative number 3 plus we have 8,000. We multiply by 6.12 and then we have 8,000. We multiply by 0.3. Multiply by negative number 3 minus negative number 8. So we calculate everything in here. So we have 178,560 kilo. CAL and that is the final we need to find in here. This is the end. Thank you for watching.